Baby, I'ma shut I'm shutting this thing down. Brush your teeth. Brush your teeth. And brush your teeth, okay? Ah, ah, what is this? Child, I got you. Come to the car, okay? I don't need you walking around with no sticky deodorant under your arms. Baby, this? This right here is what's gonna save you. In my car to not look home. Baby. I'm trying to get them full. I got a little ball spot up here, so baby, we try to work on it. But this thing is the truth. I like it. I like it a lot. I don't know, y'all, but I just start wearing them. And I like these anyway because my titties is little and I like to let them hang, okay? It don't matter where you at and who you with. Put it on, child. Hi, guys. Welcome back to my channel. Sugar Jess and Vibe Pizza, and this is my story. All right, guys. So today in this video, I'm going to be going over a couple things with you all. Basically, your 2020 starter pack. You know how they used to have them little starter pack things. Anywho, this is going to be a starter pack for car essentials, things that you're going to need while you in your car so you don't look homeless. If you homeless, because you know when you homeless, you may look a certain way, I guess. Or that's what society make you think you look, you got to look bad if you look homeless. Or, yeah, I know what I'm trying to say. Basically, I used to get a lot of comments saying, oh my gosh, she doesn't live in her car. She's too pretty to live in her car. Or she dressed too nice to live in her car. Baby, clothes is clothes, okay? Makeup is makeup. All you gotta do is put it on. It don't matter where you at and who you with. Put it on, child. So it doesn't matter, like, if you in your car or if you in your house. If you can put it on, you can put it on, okay? Yeah. Um, I also, too, a lot of people don't realize not everybody that lives in their car is, uh, have to live in their car. Maybe they decide to live in their car. It's a choice. It's not like they, you know they uh was maybe kicked out or whatever the situation was or don't have anywhere to go maybe people just do it by choice and yeah you already know i do it by choice anyways all right so we're gonna get it started and let me make sure my okay you can't really see but okay okay all right so i always bring this along with me y'all this thing has been like a freaking lifesaver like lifesaver one of my close friends as she purchased it for me for my birthday or either christmas they close to each other. They're only five days apart. I can't remember which event it was, but they purchased this for me. And this literally keeps everything in here. So, like, when I say this is the things that I use every day in the house, every day when I was in my car, just in general, when I travel, this is something that I need. Something that I need while in my car to not look homeless, okay? First thing first, child, we're going to start at the top, okay? So, what you want to do... You want to make sure you have you a toothbrush. Get it straight from Dollar Tree, okay? Toothbrush. You got yourself some toothpaste. Um, you also have some mouthwash and Listerine as well. Brush your teeth. Brush your teeth. And brush your teeth, okay? So, keep your mouth clean. That's the first couple things, okay? Moving right along, because I ain't going to try to hold y'all today, because I got things to do too, okay? All right, moving right along. So... You want to make sure you have some facial cleanser. Get the crust out of your eyes. It gotta go with that cute slobber from your face. Gotta go. All right. And then you also have some body wash. Now, I like to get the body wash inside of a tube. Honestly, because I feel like with the actual bar soap, it can kind of get messy. And with the uh, body wash, I feel like you can just throw the top on, baby, and go. And that's just that. Okay. So you want that, and you don't want to walk around with no dry face because it's not cute, okay? So you want to have yourself a little moisturizer. Why am I camera doing something funky? Baby, focus, okay? So you want to have yourself some little moisturizer, again, some type of body wash. Um, I get this stuff, like, out of the travel sections inside of Walmart, inside of Target. Them, like, my favorite places, y'all. And also get yourself some dog on face wash as well. Um... You also want to get yourself some, or always have yourself some deodorant as well. Now, for those things, especially for like your mouth and like to wash your face and stuff like that, you're going to need some water. So let me show y'all. Okay. Oh. I actually have two bottles, but I always keep a jug of water in my car. Child, because one, I get thirsty while I'm at work a jug of water and depending on what time of the year you are in your car it is okay to like have a jug of water just kind of like sitting there all the time or you can get like a filter a cup or a bottle or whatever and just go fill up some water from someplace public bathroom whatever you wherever you want to go but get yourself some water because baby this 
this right here is what's gonna save you. If you ain't got nothing, you gotta have some water, okay? Gotta have some water. The water will take you a long way, okay? A long way. So as far as your little body wash, baby, get your little smaller um body wash. You good to go. Also, uh, I like to have it's like a face rag here. So a face rag is inside of here. Um, as you guys know, like if when I travel and I stay at like hotels or someplace like that, I always bring my own uh, like washing cloths and face rags and stuff like that. Anyways, so you want to make sure you have a rag. Well, this is what I I, I like to have. Okay, because this is what I like to do. Okay rag and then you also want to have like a little towel I have that as well um another thing too so after I get like my face and my mouth cleared out and everything like that I'm good to go so now I just want to like make sure like I can see cuz y'all know I will uh, contest so <laughs> I have to keep me some extra contact solution and a contact case inside of this bag because I don't know sometimes I always be forgetting like my contact kits or either my contact solution so I always try to keep something like that extra in my car again if it's like really really hot like during the times it's really really hot in my car I don't keep certain things in my car because it's melt like that deodorant y'all it will melt I don't need you to walk around with no sticky deodorant under your arms it just ain't cute okay okay so yeah so that's that I need some contacts in my eyes or either my glasses. Uh, I do have three pairs of glasses and I'm surprised one of them is not in this bag, but yeah, that's just that. So it's a pair of panties and also a sports bra. I wear sports bra all the time because it's more comfortable. Um, also, from my understanding, I started switching over and stopped wearing wire bras and wearing these because I heard like wire bras for women can cause breast cancer and stuff like that. Um, it makes you nauseous, different things. I know y'all but i just stopped wearing them and i like these anyway because my titties is little and i like to let them hang okay yeah so that's that also i'm black okay so i need to have me a bonnet okay i don't know about y'all but your girl gotta have a bonnet or a headscarf or something around my head sometimes not all the time most of the time i got that yeah um if i'm wearing braids i would just have like a scarf just wrapped around my edges and since we own the edges baby let me go ahead and explain this okay all right so this let's let's zoom in so y'all can kind of see what i'm talking about and pick it up what i'm trying to put down here so this is edge natural okay so this is basically uh what i put on my edges here it was sent to me by this black owned company and y'all when i say this thing is the truth maybe i had to try it off for a couple of days before i come over here and tell y'all but this thing is the truth i like it i like it a lot all right so it's basically for natural edges as stated here on the bottle um on the back it basically says let me give you all some directions on what to do. So, Edge Natural helps your edges look fuller. Baby, I'm trying to get them full. I got a little bald spot up here. So, baby, we try to work on it, okay? Work on it. All right. So, it makes your edges look fuller to get the best use of the product. Apply once or twice daily to your hairline. Okay. To your hairline to apply, use your fingertips. You don't even need so much. Use your fingertips and easily rub onto your hairline. Make sure before each use that your scalp and application area are clean and clear of oils. Okay, babe. Okay. So, y'all, I honestly, when I use this, let me tell y'all the first thing first. So, when I opened this up, right, I was like, ah, ah, what is this? Look how I love y'all. Y'all, let me show y'all this. And it smells so freaking good. It's like this, uh, like cream. Come on, camera, let's focus. Don't act up. Okay, here you go. It's like this cream, like, as y'all can see, I've been kind of dipping up in there. Um, <laughs> this cream formula here, and it's like really, really smooth. I love the texture of this. It's very lightweight. And y'all, when I say this thing smells so good, it smells just like freaking peppermint. It smells so freaking good. I love this stuff, like love. And when I put it on my edges, because y'all know I like to keep them edges slicked down, child. Quit playing with my braids, with my scars, whatever, whatever. I got to have them edges looking right baby if ain't nothing looking right because y'all know i would throw a scarf on all the time hair dirty and all but i would make sure them edges is slick okay slick so with this stuff here y'all is making sure that i keep one my edges thick okay thick, thicker than the snicker okay 
And also, I can even like lay my edges down. Like today, I laid my edges down with this stuff. And y'all, it is the freaking truth. And I use this like little edge brush. Uh, even, all, hold on, come back, baby, come back. I use this little edge brush here um, that I got from the hair store. But y'all, when you use this, See them edges down, honey. You look like a whole nother human out here. You gotta be looking right and keeping it tight, okay? And get edge natural, okay? That's what you want to do, all right? So, with me, another thing that I always have to do, y'all, I always have to do, and as you guys know, probably watching all of my videos, I have to have some type of statement piece, some type of statement piece, okay? You can be looking like the bummiest of the bummiest, but I'm telling you, you have a nice little statement piece, me. I'm going to say for me, but all I need, I don't even got to have all this extra stuff. Just give me some nice earrings and my edge is slick. Baby, I'm going to shut, I'm shutting this thing down, okay? Shutting it down, I'm shutting it down, okay? So, I, I got to keep my edges right, and that's on period. And I'm going to do that with this Edge Natural here. And they're based out of Georgia. If I'm not mistaken, it's based out of Georgia. I'm going to leave their information down below. So that way you guys could check out this company. But yeah, I got to keep my edges looking right, boo. Give me some nice statement earrings, baby. <laughs> That's the word for your girl, okay? All right, so moving right along. But my ladies, there's another thing that I like to make sure I keep inside of this bag. Because you just never know. Like sometimes my little side could just be sneaking up on your girl. I'm But you're here today unexpectedly. So yeah, I like to keep me like some pads in here. Now I've been trying out some new pads. Y'all comment below any natural pads um that you all use. As you guys know, before I used to use this other type of natural pad from this company. But for some reason I can't find the company because when they first launched, um, it was just like they I guess went through and like changed their website up and things like that and changed a couple things. And now I can't find them no more. Okay, and that's just that. So I've been trying out these new natural pads from Target. This one is by Rel. It's uh, hopefully, let me see if I can get y'all to see what I, okay, yep, there it goes. This is the name of the company that I have been using so far, but I make sure I try to keep uh, some pads with me, child, because you just never know, so, or somebody you know, you know, might need it. There's been plenty of times, you know, I've been living in my car or whatever, and I be at work and somebody like, girl, do you got a little pad or something? Child, I got you, come to the car okay that's where it's at also um i picked up i just started using this i picked it up this week this is called lola's it's the ultra thin liner chow this is i got this where did i get this from i actually got this from walmart but i think if i'm not mistaken they actually sell this at target as well but it's 100 percent organic cotton it's a plant-based bioplastic non-toxic at Adhesive tone and that's for as far as the um the paper wrapping the back sheet everything like that it's free of synthetic fibers fragrance and dyes so it, oh it's raining raining okay yeah so this is what i have here as far as like my panty liners gotta have those um another thing that you need in your car because i don't need y'all to be nasty okay get yourself some um germ mats so, no, this ain't really germ. I got it's so many, y'all. Some German, some hand sanitizer. I have all like a lot of these. Not just because, because, but I always have a lot of these because I'm just weird about certain things. But yeah, so get you some hand sanitizer, some German, some something. Keep it in your car, child, please. Okay, please. All right, moving right along. Another essential that I need to have in my car, y'all. Y'all, these things here, I've been. I ain't even gonna lie. I've been wearing these things a lot lately. I got these little things from five and below. And when I say y'all, these things is the best. The best. Especially if you're gonna be sending your car when it's like warm. Not in the warm, excuse me, when it's cold outside. Baby, get, look at this mug. Hold on. Do y'all see the inside of this mug? And it's like that all the way down. And then they got the little grippers at the bottom here. And look, look. What did it look like? Little Indian shoes with some little flannel to it. But I got these from Five and Below for only five dollars. And y'all, these things feel so freaking good. As you guys know, or you probably don't know, because maybe this is your first time here, so I'ma let you know. Like my feet get cold, my hands get my feet and my hands is always cold. So I gotta wear like socks or something like that. Anyhow, this is what I like to wear. Okay, I love these things. They're so comfortable, y'all. Them feet be oh, them feet be feeling good. Yes. 
So that's just what that is, okay? So I, I basically showed y'all everything that I use. Oh wait, I lied, it's Mo. All right, this, Summer Eve. I talk about this crap all the time in most of my videos, but for you, I'ma need you ladies to use this Simply Sensor sensitive cleansing cloth these are, are by summer eve now i get these from walmart or either amazon amazon is like a dollar and something i'm not sure how much it costs in walmart but you can get it from walmart as well but yeah i use this too um you can use this also uh some makeup white removers i always have is that in here no i think those are no well anywho get yourself some makeup right removers some um what is it called some baby wipes to wipe your tail okay and this but i honestly feel like if this is good enough for the kitty cat it, it got to be good for the, the underarms too right yeah just don't use the same one the one in your kitty cat and then move it to your arms or move it from your arms to your kitty cat baby switch it out but yeah uh huh yeah use this baby i'm telling you this is the truth it's way it's at. So those are my couple essential things that I need while living in my car, y'all, because it is what it is, okay? And that's how the hell I don't be looking homeless because I be looking right. You ain't got to not look right. You know what I'm saying? And sometimes I have my makeup, but I ain't got my makeup in here today, y'all. But anyway, yes. When I move back in my car, it's going to be a whole nother situation. I feel like I'm so much more prepared this time. Like, because I've done it for over a year, I kind of know, like, what to do and what to look for kind of thing. I feel like my first year was just, like, my testing year or whatever. But now we're back here again. So, yeah, it's cool. I had, like, a small talk, like, a little, little small talk with my mom. I never, it, like, came out and told my parents that I was moving back into my car. They would just, like, hint little things that I would say or, like, because I don't even think they watch my videos all the time. My mom, she'll tell me like certain things. Oh, I saw this video when you were talking about this and that. But I'm pretty sure she don't watch every single video, man. So, um, yeah. She asked me about it today. She was like, so what is this? You moving back into your car? And I was like, yeah. Yeah, girl. Yeah. But she she didn't seem um too bad about it. Not too bad. I don't think she seemed too bad about it. Uh, I, th I think she's okay because she probably knows like from me doing it before that you know I made sure I took care of myself and stuff like that I've been in an apartment for a year now she was super happy when I moved into my apartment like super super happy um yeah and of course this time around I'm going to be doing different things I haven't spoken on it yet but it's going to be like a lot of things I'm going to be doing I'm going to be mostly like traveling a lot um so Y'all just gotta stay tuned. Y'all just gotta stay tuned. So it's just, it's just so much more. And I think once she, like, once I actually give her the rundown, she kind of see like how things is gonna be. Um, she'll probably like open up a little bit more. But yeah, I told my stepdad. He didn't really say anything about it. And my sisters, they know. My grandmother, she was straight up like, I don't want you to move back in your car. I was like, Yeah, I know. But then again, at the same time, she's like helping me look for a van. <laughs> Her and my grandfather's like helping me look for a van. So I don't know. It's just like mixed feelings with everybody. And I understand because of like my safety and stuff. But my family already know like I'm pretty different. Like I, I don't want to live like the normal life. I just kind of like want to do my own thing and want to do things differently because that's just like what I like to do. So yeah. <sighs> I'm excited though. At the end of the day, you're going to decide okay so yeah that's that um i got some more videos coming for you guys uh like a lot of different things that's coming up too so i just can't i just can't wait to share so much with y'all it's just like i'm getting all hyped all over again like how i was like living in my car i was looking at my older videos y'all and i also did some reaction videos to my old videos but y'all gotta stay tuned for that too and y'all just to listen to the excitement in my voice and just to look at like the energy i was giving off like I'm, I was watching my video as if I was a fan of my own self, which I am, because, I mean, if you ain't a fan of yourself, you need to be, basically, yeah, that's just what I'm trying to say here, okay? So, yeah, I was just, like, watching stuff like that, and I was just, like, darling, like, look at how happy I am, like, like, oh my god, I just can't wait to get back into that space, even though I feel like this time is going to be so much better all the way around. I'm just super, 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 super excited. So yeah, that's that, y'all. 
Alright guys, so that's one wrap things up for my video today. Thank you all so much for stopping by and watching. Do not forget to like, comment, and subscribe, and always stay vibrant. Peace.